It is the Beyonce performance that has angered many in the law enforcement community. And that's new at 10. She could be facing some backlash in Tampa for her upcoming concert. Over her song, Formation, Crystal Clark, live outside TPD headquarters. Why, Crystal? Yeah, Mark, apparently Beyonce has ticked off police enough that many of them here in Tampa are refusing to work her upcoming concert April 29th. Police now have two months to try to fill those empty shifts. Beyonce lit the field on fire at this year's Super Bowl halftime show, but her performance and new song Formation are taking plenty of heat. And I thought it was really outrageous that uh, that she used it as a platform to attack police officers. Hey, what's my, hey, what's my, the music video set in New Orleans shines a light on police brutality. It features a wall that reads stop shooting us. She also appears on top of a sinking police cruiser. It's the kind of message some officers in Tampa say is too political and unfair. We live in a society where people are pretty pretty polarized about their politics and they probably have some very strong feelings. And those strong personal beliefs have spilled over into the workplace. Over the past couple of weeks, no officers have signed up to work security at the upcoming Beyonce concert at Raymond James Stadium. Typically, off-duty officers take extra work at concerts and games for extra income. This is a couple months away, so we've still got plenty of time to, to fill those slots. Since the Super Bowl, officers around the nation have been critical of the Beyonce's message. Last week, a Detroit sergeant's Facebook post sparked an internal investigation. The post read, if the dance troupe at the top is okay for this year's halftime show, then the one at the bottom should be okay for next year, right? Would that be acceptable if a band, a white band, came out in hoods and uh, white sheets in the same sort of fashion, we would be appalled and outraged. Tampa police officials say not having officers in uniform at the April concert that's expected to sell out is a security risk and one they're not willing to take. Regardless of how controversial it might be or who the artist might be or the politician might be, we're going to staff it because we have a responsibility to do that. And police wouldn't clarify if officers already assigned to work that night could be forced to work that venue instead. They say they still have two months to figure things out. But if that is the case, they say they'll make sure other areas of the city remain staffed that night. Mark? Interesting dilemma here. Crystal Clark tonight at TPD. Thanks.